Hey, what's up? This is Dan, first person looter, and I am back today, pretending to be a tough GTA character of some sort. This is video number seven playing Grand Theft Auto V on the Xbox Series S. Not worried about the daily quests and whatever on the Xbox, because uh, Microsoft is terrible. I still stand by that. <clears throat> and then, you know, we have Xbox owned studios trying to argue with um, people who, el who have legitimate uh, Plants about Starfield, so yeah, screw Microsoft. Anyway, uh, let's get back into video number seven as I play on a Microsoft console downloaded from a Microsoft gaming service. All right, so here we are with Trevor Still, Trevor Still, and uh. Right, I had to come outside to see the city map. I have a car, very good. And uh, do we have question marks? I like to do those first. Well, oh, the question mark is, oh my god. Yes, yeah, so the question mark is pretty far away. But that's what I want to do first, so I'll get my, my driving going. <coughs> oh, or meet me down at the lodge and we'll go hunt some real game. Hmm. He walks funny. What does he do? Why does... His gait is all weird. Is that the word? Gait? His walking? His gait? I love how this truck looks like a, like a truck you would find in an old toy set from like the 50s. Flying school. Hmm. Oh, now there's an area with cars parked all over the place. Yeah, there's a car parked in the parking lot. There's cars parked in the parking lot. There's cars parked on the road. Yeah, give me all the cars in the world. When I don't need to find one, because I have one. More. Little smart car. Every car. That's another thing. Cars come out of the other direction. Out of the uh, perpendicular direction. At almost every intersection, right when I'm ready to come through. And always cars that are on the opposite side of the road when I'm passing a car on my side of the road. You're going to turn right, right? I mean, it's red. Lights are red. Okay. The lights are always red. This light's red, too. See? They're all red. All the lights are red. Oh, this one's green. Oh, good. Thank you for proving me wrong, game. Oh my god, now I got like heard me. Now I got all, now I got all green lights. Wow. Oh my god, he slumped over the wheel. Blood on the dashboard and blood all on the windshield. Left him slump over the wheel with his wig pill. Brains on the dashboard and blood all on the windshield. Wonderful. A veritable treasure trove. That's a perfectly good sock. And an entire courgette. Just ignore us. Yes, don't mind us. Pretend we're not here. Okay. Nigel and Mrs. Thornhill. Cranley, are you? Actor and artist. I love your work. Oh, stunt double. Oh, our favorite show. Mrs. Thornhill, snap. Watch the birdie. Oh, we pretend to throttle me. <laughs> yeah, yeah, like you did on that, on that poster you did. Yeah, okay, all that would be my pleasure. <laughs> oh. uh, like that, huh? Yeah? Oh. Like that. Maybe something oh. like this? Or oh. like that? Huh? You like that? That's enough, huh? dear. You like that? Oh! 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 oh. 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 Hey! Oh. Oh. Thank hmm. you. Wow, that's quite a woman oh. there, huh? Oh. We are not worthy. We're, We're not, not worthy. worthy. We're, We're not, not I'm, uh, I'm not Jock, uh, what's his name? Cranley! 
big star in the 80s. We well, love celebs. Oh. That's why we came to Tinseltown. Yes, before we met you, we were trying to break in to Bruce Spade's house and steal his rubbish. The things these stars throw away. They're not like you or me. <laughs> Mrs. Thornhill has the most unbelievable collection of celebrity underwear and bathroom products things they've actually used themselves you that sounds great let's go get it all right i gotta go we <clears throat> help all this climbing over walls and rooting through bins it's such a business nigel's got an arthritic knee yeah. what do you uh, me too just well, my knee hurts anyway maybe it's arthritis i don't know what it is look look at this map i mean a lot of these places have Famous people living in them, and some that are just hanging about. Bring us some things. I'd be very thankful indeed. Americans are the most wonderful people in the world, aren't they? The best. <laughs> Such fun. <laughs> no, we're not. Ah, a pair of fruit cakes. Mmm, cake. So what, this is the house you want me to break into? No icon here. <clears throat> there looks like a new icon opened up somewhere right here. Cletus. Okay, no. I guess that was from the text message. If that's with Michael, so that would be a pretty big mission, I think. So maybe we'll do one of these little guys down here. We'll shoot up some more rednecks. I guess. Maybe it's something totally different. Or it's, it is rednecks, but in a whole different location. Look at that car coming on the other side of the street as I'm trying to pass this car. I'm telling you, that's the pattern. The majority, not all the time, but the majority of the time. Areas where you can find celebrity items has been marked on the map. Oh, there we go. Okay. Oops, keep hitting the wrong button. Oh, what is this little thing? Tennis, oh, okay. I thought that was like a magnifying glass, like you can search around here for stuff. Okay, so I'm heading in the right direction for... Celebrity thievery. Very good. A lot of fancy cars here to take. Wow. What is that big tall tower? Can you get a, I bet you there will be a story mission in that tall tower. Because that's such an... And that's such a sight. down right in front of him right crouch right crouch and then what is it just trigger no puede ser. my crunchy screechy shoes uh. <laughs> what the fuck is that oh. you saw me how do I pick up the body and hide it Flat and gross the door graphics are. You could tell you can't open those. Come on, get in the hot tub with me. 
with me. I'm bored. I think that pill you gave me is wearing off. I've been watching you do laps for like two hours. Hey, who the fuck are you? Yo, what do you think you're doing here, man? This is private property. Just pretend I'm not here, kids. <laughs> He's crazy. I'm calling the cops. God damn it. Is there a way to get around them? Damn it. I guess I failed the mission, huh? Wait, where is Michael's house? Oh my god, that's crazy. their way did Chloe put you up to this Ew! he looks like a crackhead don't get any more uh, sorry blame it on the mummy issues Why do these celebrities make such a drama about everything? Hello? This is Nigel. Please be quick. I'm roaming in the United States of America. It's me, you nutcase. I picked up some clothes from your friend Tyler Dixon. There's even a skid mark. What fantastic news! Wait till Mrs. Thornhill hears about this. Oh, she will be... Please as punch. Trade man's entrance. Don't mind if I do.
shirt that <clears throat> Fatal Incursion. That's the shirt that the insane clown posse guy. I can't believe we're parting with Love Fist's manager. That's so cool. Oh, some of the shit I've seen, Love, it's unimaginable. You know, if Jez and the guys hadn't gotten so into yoga and probiotics nowadays. I bet I could hit your G-sharp every time. You guys were amazing tonight. Ah, you know. Chin Stainer is like my ultimate breakup song. That track is so fucking layered, man. It's like a renaissance painting buried in all the knobs and titties as art. You know what I mean? You got any tune gum or... <laughs> okay, okay. Calm the fuck down. Just tell me what you want.
Guess what, you crazy English fruitcake? Oh, I'm dreadful at guessing, aren't I, Mrs. Thornhill? No, she can't hear me. She's washing out a nappy from <laughs> Samantha Muldoon's dustbin. Yeah, uh, one gold tooth, courtesy of Love Fist, complete with complimentary DNA. Marvelous, marvelous. Oh, Jock, I knew you wouldn't let us down. Toodaloo! Too much going on here in in my real life world right now, uh, and I couldn't focus on doing it. And then I had the wrong buttons, and then and then all I did was I just tried to hide behind the wall, and then it and then it and then it like brought out a gun automatically, and I quickly tried to switch to the fists. But by that point, it was too late. They were already screaming and running, so I'm trying to hit them. But whatever, for whatever reason, none of the buttons I'm hit, pressing on the controller are punching him. And he just runs out of the... I could have gotten it all done in the club, easy peasy, and it turned into that whole giant mess. And I didn't... I thought I just... <clears throat> I thought it was going to be the same as the last mission, where I had to find the item sitting somewhere and pick it up and I was going to try to be as stealth as possible but this one I I had to I had to deal with the people there fine <laughs> how do you get in here the golfing thing top golf the sirens, the sirens aren't for me. Anyone else see this? Oh yeah, there's a golfing icon. I see it. Mm-hmm. golf cart. Perfect. No, no. In order to get this one, I have to like hit a hole in one. Steal the golf club from Mark. Ostenberg. Can you actually play golf here? <clears throat> is it in, in his little golf cart or is it in his bag? Does he have a caddy? I'm finally feeling good about my downswing. Oh, but they got you can't drive through here, buddy. What? Well, I didn't know that there was going to be security with them, and that they were going to shoot me immediately without you. Gave, you barely gave me a second. You told me to leave. I, okay. You didn't. You didn't give me a chance to leave. What the? What? So you don't take me to. You don't put me in the hospital. That's good. I don't lose money, and I'm not super far away. But you don't give me my golf cart either. And now all the golf carts are gone. Get my stamina, um, stats up. Okay, I, I thought they were... There's an exact replica of me hitting balls in Omsk as we speak. 
Hey, you! Get out of here! How do they see me so quickly? Sometimes I wish I wasn't so photogenic. Woo! I'm on fire today. Sure, it's nice not to be on set for once. Hey! Where do you think you're going? Oh, oh shit. <laughs> I was fo I got in my golf cart. I was following them. Now you can just shoot him. Then he can't get away. We got a breach. Well, you locked onto the wrong goddamn person. Great. Hey, where do you think you're I going? Reload, oh, for fuck's sake. You just keep locking onto the wrong goddamn. I, I'm all the way over here. Oh my god. Oh, Why wouldn't you lock onto the person that I'm the most closest to aiming? Wouldn't you think that that's who I need help shooting? Would you what? Yes, what what golf club? Oh there? Okay, I see. In this fucking car? In this little piece of shit? Oh my god. This is the way out. There he is. Oh, I guess I could have just. Damn. Naturally. 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 Turned around 180 degrees again. Naturally. <clears throat> what the? No way. Hey. Word up! I said it, Mrs. Thornhill. I, uh, persuaded Mark Faustenberg to donate one of his golf clubs to your museum of dysfunction. 
Oh, bravo! It will take pride of place on the wall above Jill von Krastenberg's pregnancy test. <laughs> Speak to you soon. I love Americans. You're all so brash and uncomplicated. Even right there, there's n there was no reason for that car to turn into my lane like that. Even if I was slightly turning into hers, you, you wouldn't turn further into the situation. You would turn your steering wheel away from me, not towards me. What the fuck is wrong that with you? freaked me out, all those windows turning on. More red lights. Oh, now green. It's like when I say red light, all of a sudden it changes on me. It's a magic word. Car right on the other side of the road as I'm trying to pass the car on my side of the road. That always happens. Just take it. It's thrift store anyway. Red light. I said red light, so now you go green, right? Red light. You're turning right at the intersection that I need to turn right at. Red light. Red light. Red light. Car turning when I need to turn. Red light. Car's turning when I need to turn. Green light. Yay. Almost red. Car on the other side of the road as I'm trying to pass. Red light. Red light. There's that flashing light over there. So look at the hooey, yeah. <laughs> Hey, ese, que onda? You say, amigo? Where you from, Bato? It's none of your business, huh? Okay? Hey, it's uh, a slight uh, accent. Uh, Fuck you. Uh, hey, so uh, I grew up in Canada, uh, huh? huh? What's a big fucking deal? Uh, you fucking whoa, whoa, racist! Whoa, 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 whoa. And before hey. you fucking ask! Chill, Holmes, chill. No, I'm not a motherfucker! Not 
laughing now, are you? Fun of my accent! Show some fucking torrents! I really thought I did way better that time. <clears throat> the game believes otherwise. Is there a set number of rampages or do they just keep... Yeah, they just keep doing more rampages. Where'd my car go? Why is this car just sitting there? Go. Red light. Red light. Car crossing me. Red light. Car is turning where I need to turn. Red light. Oh shit. Nice piece, dog. Hey, hey, yo, yo, who the fuck is this motherfucker? Hey, what's cracking on me? What you doing around here, man? Me? Yeah, you motherfucker. In purple because they don't want to. The game developers don't want to uh, represent Bloods or Crips, so just someone in the middle. It's not legally fucking if you do not. Oh, this is basically like Los Angeles, so what are they, like LA Lakers fans? He's running away, you shouldn't shoot him in the back, he's running away. It's like innocent, the threat is over. You don't shoot someone when they're not a threat anymore. Jesus, perfect time to reload, okay. Maybe they're... Maybe they're Orlando Magic fans, even though they're in... Uh... California. Come on, homies! There's only one of me! Come on, homies, he said? Oh my god. Flicking is not working. Flicking the L the R stick. Some real gangsters. I'm shooting the metal. I can. He said, "All right." Am I supposed to be scared of you? Destroy two vehicles, okay. Trevor's Huntley S has been impounded. Vehicles can be recovered.
stir, you piece of shit! It's gonna strip the screw there. I can't put the cap on. No, it's a nut, man. You just screw it back on. What are you doing here, citizen? I said, what are you doing here, citizen? Nothing. Oh, I'm sorry. You're clearly a tourist. For our friends from up north, eh? A boot? Don't even say it like that! There's a moose loose, a boot to hoos! Fuck you, Hoosier! Hey, hey, what's hey, that? Fuck hey, hey, oh, Jesus! It's a faint hey. fucking accent! Get out of you here. can hardly come on, tell! Come on! Hey, insurgent! Shit. Insurgent! We have contact! We have contact! Win wars anymore. Get down. Is this the best the US military has to offer? Been muted this whole time. A lot going on, my friends. Are you like not supposed to kill them? Is that why they keep like getting up? Driver like me. Loose? Really? Is loose now? Attack! Oh! Really? For one Canadian? Bunch of glorified Boy Scouts! I think I actually got the tank. Oh, I got the tank like fast. Was 
in the Air Force! I serve my country! Canadian Air Force? Foreigners. I saw a faint red dot back there. Oh, Jesus, don't let them. Don't let them crash that into me. Oh, it's a tank. Oh. I don't even sound that Canadian! <laughs> that one faint red dot makes me think there was one soldier who out of the truck. See, this is why we don't win wars anymore. <laughs> reload, reload. Military has to off. Blew up the other truck at the same time. That's good. Six, five, four, three. I don't have anyone to shoot. Two of three. All right. Headshots. How would you possibly get a headshot? I got two headshots. I don't even know how I would have done that. Did I pick this up? No. Whoa. Oh, did you hit me? Oh. Don't shoot me. Yeah. Oh. yeah, I didn't do it. Are there any non blown up trucks that I can use? He's already taking it. All right. Put me in a place with no parking. Oh, boy. Hipsters next to a hip barber shop, I'm sure. Okay, there's a store down the way, so maybe if there's a store down here, maybe there's a parking lot for the store. And if there's a po look at the deal. Oh, it's so majestic. Don't run away. No. I think I see at least one car over there. No, oh, no. That's a plant. See, you, you, you give me a place. You drop me off with my car and there's cars parked everywhere. You put me in a place where, uh, <clears throat> without my car, and there's no cars to take. And if I pull out a gun, it not going to make them stop. And then the cops are going to get called. And then I got to deal with all of that. I feel like it'll be a bigger hassle than just running like this. Someone please, what was that? I'm so dead. Is this like Red Dead Redemption, where you got like people on the street that you... Oh, is it tied up? What the fuck? Please! Come on, man! Untie it's, me! It's cool that there's like some weird, random, interesting... Oh, thank God. I'm in so much trouble. Can you give me a ride? Please! Nope. I you, I promise. No, I can't. Mm, naked road trip. I'm in. This is such a disaster. I'm supposed to be getting married. With what car? Get suit from home, and pick up the car, then trek down, Soon to be dead, best man. Pray to fuck, he still has the rings. 
Get to the church. In, like, five hours. I promised her I wouldn't go crazy. She's gonna kill me. I'm such an idiot. No car. What the fuck do you want me to do about that? I got no goddamn car. Not a parking lot in sight. I can hail a cab? Would that work with a... What Jesus. Find this taxi cab, please. On its way, sir. Thanks for calling. Much obliged. And that yellow dot was the cab, but... Oh, that right there? Press Y to enter a taxi as a passenger. Hold Y to jack a taxi. Jack a taxi. Where you headed, homie? Is he in there with me? Can I, can I zoom out to see if he's in here with me? The ceremony starts at 10 a.m. Okay. Downtown Vinewood. All right, let's hit the road. My dick is burning. I'm so dehydrated. Is that the place we're supposed stopped. to go? I don't know what I would have done. Well, I stopped because I got a soft spot for a man in panties. A few cars went by, but nobody stopped. Nobody would help. They we're would actually going out. to where he needs Pulled to go. The window, laugh and point. Take photos and then speed off. I was on my bachelor party. Mmm, that part I got. It's the stripped and tied to a post in the middle of nowhere bit. That's what I'm interested in. <laughs> Come on. I want sort of details. Oh, hurry. Dude, I have no recollection. It was supposed to be a few oh, good. We can go faster. Then Beautiful. The came out. Then the coke came out. Skip for an extra cost. Oh, God. really out of hand. They made me finger a L to change destination. I don't want to do that, but I want to see what that's like. Eh, yeah, these things happen. Last thing I remember, I was stuffing a oh. handful of mushrooms in my mouth. As you do. Go on. Next thing I know, I wake up there with a deer gnawing at my balls. It's a low point. He didn't turn where my GPS on, said to turn. Here? Turn here? It smells cheap. I don't know. No, uh, wait. Right. Shit, no. There was a stripper, I think. And a midget. Or a stripper midget. Oh. Oh, God. All the hallmarks of a classic night out. I don't know what the problem is. I've really done it this time. How am I going to be able to say these vows, man? Hey, oh, amigo, shit. It's going to start any minute. Downtown Vinewood. Whatever you say. This one time, Lacey Jones got in the back of my cab. How do you change the destination? All right, well, now we're going right. Coke in the back there. Oh. Oh. Hey, buddy, change your plan. Look out! I want to get there in one piece. Vinewood okay, Hills. I know we're in a hurry, but really? That's no big I don't want to be walking down the aisle with. And now we're stuck. The car is stuck. This is going to turn into a funeral, not a wedding. I want to get there in one piece! Well, even here, even when I'm not the actual driver, there's gonna be a car. <laughs> Earning when I need to... And a car passing when I'm trying to go around. So even when you are not the driver. And you're not going to pass because it's a double yellow line? Oh my god. Are you serious? We're 
We're gonna go this slow the whole time now. Hurry, hurry! She's gonna be walking down the aisle! Yeah, I'll drop you here. All right, here you go. I just realized we have a timer. Oh my god. I definitely would have failed on a taxi going behind that slow-ass car. Oh my god. This car fast? I always wanted to try this car. Finally get a chance, dude. I didn't realize there was a timer there. Okay, that's the car I'm arriving in for the wedding. You jump in and wait while I get changed quickly. It's my father-in-law's. This bastard. He loves this car more than he loves his own daughter. Oh, it's a miracle I'm helping you at all. When will I learn to leave a naked man on the side of the road? Okay, at least I look like I'm getting married now. I got a message from my best man saying he's in a restaurant out of town. If he's lost the wedding... I'm not making it in 57 seconds. Come on, pick up. Who do you think it is? A so-called friend you tied to a pole in the middle of nowhere with no fucking clothes on? We don't have time for this now. Just tell me you have the rings. Unbelievable! One thing you haven't yet completely fucked up. Stay there, don't move, I'm on my way! Okay, the good news is, he's in a seafood diner on the way to the church. You step 180. We might make this. Ooh, 360. Only that douche would be eating lobster at a time like this. This is gonna be so Whoa! close. Oh shit, no! It's trashed in a car! Oh, I'm gonna be... Rated on how well the car is conditioned. Please, you have no idea how much he loves this car. Okay, I know we're in a hurry, but really? to literally castrate me. Five seconds. So wait, I failed. Am I going to have to do this all over again? And it's going to start me without a car again? Honey, is that you? Calm down. No, what? No, <gasps> no, no, no. Just stay there. I'm on my way. Honey, but she hung up on me. It's over. Just get away from me. My life is ruined. And you're going to leave me without a car again. A big fucking waste of time. I'm surrounded by tons and tons of cars that I can't get. See? They just speed up. Screw you! Hey, 
finally. Excuse me. What the? And the car I pick is a slow ass piece of shit car, okay. No chance of uh, fleeing the cops at this speed. This car's in front of me. I don't wanna go I guess I don't wanna go too fast if there's God, this dead ends. Stay off the road. No. Okay. That's not for me. Oh my god. Oh my god, this looks like a Toyota Tercel. These both kind of look like Toyota Tercels. Holy cow. You only have yourself to blame. Yeah, run, run into the car that's moving. That's true, you do only have yourself to blame. That's actually true. This Vulcan, so it's basically, it, it does look like a Volvo, that's true. It also looks like a Toyota Tercel. Why does my line go away when I'm under the tunnel? Because, like, GPS satellites can't find me? Volcar, yeah, so I guess it's supposed to be like a Volvo. But to me... Reminds me of a Toyota Tercel, and if you don't know what a Toyota Tercel is, perhaps if you've watched Breaking Bad, season one, the car that Jesse drives is a red Toyota Tercel. My family had a green Toyota Tercel, not this color green, it was more of a lightish, palish, aquamarine green. More green than blue, but not this sort of hunter mustard slash pine green mixture. Are slowing down, having trouble getting up the hill. Oh no. Are right there as I'm trying to pass. There you go. Baby, what are you doing? Neighbors are gonna see this. You're always at that fucking golf course. You know I've got a competition coming up. Can we talk about this inside? Oh, really? You think I was born yesterday? Go play golf at midnight. That's it. it. Walk away like you always do. Hey, you. Listen, can you give me a ride? My wife's gone crazy. I'll throw some dollars your way. We'll need a vehicle first, unless you're looking for a piggyback. See what I can conjure up. Okay, I'll wait here and take a good long look at my life, strewn all over the front yard. 
Thanks, men. Just let me grab my favorite iron. Just not getting that. What a mess. A really great wardrobe out for all to see. Whatever. I can't deal with it right now. No timer. Can you drop me off at the golf club in Richmond? At least I know I'll be welcome there. I take it you're leaving your underwear in the driveway then? Yeah, I'm not giving her the satisfaction of cleaning that up. I'll go to the club, get a few drinks in me, and hope either her meds have kicked in or the gin is worn off by the time I get back. I appreciate you doing this, by the way. I, I know it's kind of a weird one. What's your name? T. Rever. Good to meet you. I'm Castro. What? What is that? Italian? Spanish? Pure wasp, I'm afraid. My sister's called Muffy, so I think I got off lightly. So, what was that all about? Ah, just the usual psycho female stuff. She thinks I've got another woman on the side. And have you? That's not the point. She doesn't know that I have one. Okay, guy to guy now. I have a very strict code. Only on out-of-town trips, no real names. Hey! A dead trail. That's a gentleman's way, right? Uh, I'm not sure I'm your boy for moral compass questions. I'm good like that. I don't want to embarrass her. Then she goes and literally airs our dirty laundry in front of all the neighbors. I mean, show some class. So, let me get this straight. You're pissed because she's accusing... If you just drop me off at the entrance here, that'd be great. You're pissed because she's accusing you of cheating when she doesn't know you've cheated, even though you have cheated. Exactly. It's a lack of trust. She'd be accusing me of it even if I hadn't. I've never done anything at that golf club except play golf. And that's the god-honest truth. Which is more than I could say about her spin class instructor. In fact, I wonder if her fat ass is admissible as evidence in court. Because if she's doing that much spinning, it should be like a bowling ball by now. Anyway, sorry. You don't need to hear this. Oh, don't worry. I pretty much switched off when you said your name was Castro. Money doesn't buy you happiness. It just buys you a lot of therapy to talk about why you're not happy. Thank God for golf. That's all I say. Do you play? I've been known to dabble. What a game. True sport of kings. You know, they still don't let women on the course in Los Santos. It's a throwback to a less confusing time when everyone knew who they were. I can't wait to get to the club. See the guys? Forget all about this. Okay, I am done with this. I'm gonna see if I can flag down a cab. Well, we've thought about it and we really want to have a natural birth. Funny. Hey, hey, hey! Dope heads like you. Well, I was waiting for him to finish his story. Whatever, fine. Another failed mission. I. It sounded like Will, uh... sounded like Chris Parnell's voice. A little bit, but... Letting him finish his goddamn story. Guess that's lesson learned. Don't don't worry about the story in this game. I always talk to you while you're driving, and it's hard to pay attention to the story while they're, while you're driving. And if you stop so you can listen to them, then they fail you, fail the mission. Fine. That was close. Lesson learned. I'm not gonna focus on the story when I'm driving. I'm not gonna worry about it. Tell me where I'm supposed to point and shoot. Red light. Of course you're turning right when I'm here. Sure you are. Red light again. Oh, green light, but I have all these stopped cars basically turning it into a red light. I'm oh, about to be red. Red light. Red light. Car turning. Trying to cut me off. Green light. Yay. Red light, red light. Oh, green, wow. Car turning right where I need to be. I think I've made my point clear. I'm not going to keep mentioning all of that as I drive. I'm seeing all the hipster dresses. Yep. I'm talking about something that's very much post, post irony. But he wouldn't understand that. He's a typical loose. I told him I'd make a movie about his ass and call it Cunts in America. But that would be the post-ironic use of the word cunt, both offensive and at the same time curiously anodyne. <clears throat> hey, what the fuck? 
I find your t-shirt more than a little offensive. If there's one thing I cannot stand, it's post-ironic hipsters. If you don't like it, you can go back to Canada, dude! Come on, you want a piece of me, huh? Oh, wait! Oh, fuck! Oh, Run, fuck. you little fuck! Everything for everyone! are now unlocked. What does that mean? Oh, I can just do I can go back and do them anytime. Okay. Little Vespa? <laughs> yeah, there they are. They're hogging up my screen. Can I hide them? <laughs> 